Good afternoon. Time to jump on here and talk tech. Motorcycle tech. So, I kind of had a hard time deciding what to talk about tonight. But I think we're going to talk tires. Tires are very important. Tires and brakes. Something that you don't go cheap on. You don't scrimp on. I want the best tire I can get. So, what is that, you might ask? Is it the factory tire Dunlop? Or is it the Michelin C2s? Or is it some other brand? I'm not real open for discussion on it, but to each his own. I don't believe that tires is a place to go cheap. You know, the cheap brand that's gonna save you a few bucks. Nah, I'm not a fan of that. So for me, the choice is the Michelin or the Dunlop. And I watched a video the other day from the law-abiding biker, Ryan Erlacher, I think is how you pronounce it. He is a moto cop, a trainer, a motorcycle moto cop trainer, and he puts a lot of hard miles on motorcycles. His take on it is the C2s are a good tire if you just a casual rider, mostly dry roads, don't get real aggressive. It's a good tire, you're gonna get more miles out of it. He likes the Dunlops for handling, the handling in wet weather, and his extreme riding style. Now he rides fast, he rides extreme, and he likes the way the Dunlop handles. You don't get quite as many miles out of them, but the performance is there. He's got a video out, look him up on YouTube, check it out. He gives you a whole rundown of it. And um, I've always kind of gone along those lines myself, you know. I'll, I'll run one or the other. I've always ran Dunlops. I'm running the C2s this time. Um, I don't have any complaints about them. Haven't really rode them in the rain. Haven't been in much, much wet weather, so I don't have a lot to say from personal experience. Um, after watching his video and whatnot, I'm going to see what kind of mileage I get out of these. But to me, as what he said, you know, mileage is one thing, but safety and handling and whatnot is another. So for me, I, I don't care about a couple thousand more miles. I've been getting 15,000 out of my Dunlops. I've always ran them. Since I've been running Harleys, I've always ran the Dunlops, the factory tires. I, don't, I can't remember what they are, 600 something, six, whatever they are. Anyway, um, and I've never had a complaint and I've rode them in a lot of rain. I rode them in Ohio, the torrential rainstorms, hauling ass down the roads, um, in a pack, in a rain with water, deep on the roads and I've never had any problems. So, you know, that I can say, but I have not ran the C2s in much rain, little wet roads here and there maybe, but nothing, nothing major. So, um, they ride nice, they seem sticky. Uh, they handle different, it is a different feel. You do notice the difference, but um, otherwise, it seems like pretty comparable to me. The off brands, I know people that buy them and run them. I wouldn't touch them. That's just my personal, personal me. Um, I'll sell an extra hot dog or something because I'm not going to run a cheap tire on my bike. Same with my brakes. When it comes time to buy brakes, I go, I put the OEM equipment back on it. Um, I don't wait as soon as it needs it. It gets it. And it's just a couple of things that you don't mess around with because your life depends on it. You got a little bit of rubber on the road, two wheels, not four. So you need every advantage you can get. And to me, good tires and good brakes are a very sound investment. 
I'll, I'll spend whatever I have to to get those. I put a lot of miles on. Um, and I don't ride way extreme, but I'm not a Sunday rider either. Um, I like the corners. I like the speed. And so my riding style is, you know, of course it's not going to be that of a motor cop because it's not, I don't ride that aggressive, but when it comes to corners, yeah, I might have some fun when I like that. So anyway, that, that's my two cents on, on tires and, and, uh, brakes and stuff. Uh, it's just not, it's not somewhere to go cheap, you know, think about it and put out the extra few bucks and get yourself a good tire and uh, make sure you keep your brakes when they need to change, change them. Don't wait, it's something you gotta have. You can't stop without them. So, anyway, my two cents. Hope everybody's enjoying out there. I know some people that are all headed to Sturges or headed off to rallies and getting ready to go to Sturges and stuff. Um, enjoy, you guys be safe out there. I'm not going to make it this year. I am going to shoot for next year and see what happens and see if I can get away and go to Sturges. A lot can happen between now and then. Hell, who knows where I'll even be. So we'll see. But uh, I haven't been in a while. Actually, it's been a long while. So I'm due. We'll see if I can get there next year, plan it, and do it. Get my lady to go with me and we'll ride. And It'll be fun. Maybe we can hook up with some of these people that we've met online and stuff. Look forward to that. One day, I hope to cross paths with everybody at one point or another. So, anyway, you guys stay safe out there. Watch out for the other guy, the other cars. Watch out for everybody that's trying to run us over and uh, arrive safely to your destinations. Enjoy yourselves. Have a great day. Peace.